Here are five more tequilas that I want to encourage you to try. Terralto, this is another one coming out of NOM 1579, El Pendillo, Felipe Camarena. Again, changing the water composition with this Terralto. This is really well made. This is priced really well. Uh, if you find some of this, give it a try. It's delicious tequila. Aldez, this is NOM 1480. This distillery is putting out a handful of different brands that are all really, really solid. Aldez is one of the most solid ones coming out of there. I had the owners, uh, married couple Jen and Manny on the show last year. I was really impressed with their knowledge and how involved they are with this brand. Uh, uh, go find them, Aldez, find their website. You can purchase this through their website. Tequila General Gorostieta. Uh, this is Luis Torres. Man, this guy is passionate about the story of the general. This is a true general, a great story. I uh, want to encourage you to, to listen to the episode where he was on it, uh, sharing this story. But he has partnered with Ana Maria Romero. She's fantastic tequila maker. Uh, they're making this now at 1414. It was at a different distillery. This is now at the Vivanco Distillery. They've got this Blanco and they've got the Hoven both really great. Encourage you to try these. In Solito, I am really impressed with this brand. Uh, they are coming up on the show, so you want to make sure you catch that. This is confirmed added to free. Yeah, there's a little bit of that celebrity tequila with this. You've got the band Midland, but do not be fooled and do not count this out. This is really well made and a great looking bottle in Solito. And lastly, another one from the Vivanco, now 1414. Uh, this is John Bollinger and Sergio Cruz. Sergio Cruz is running point on a lot of the things coming out of Nam 1414, but yeah, yo, this is a clean, crisp Blanco. This is like 40 bucks, 45 bucks. Man, I would pick this any day over a Patron or something else that's a little more mainstream, but grab some yeah, yo, really, really great. These are all tequilas that I would gladly encourage you to try. Let me know in the comments if you've had any of these or if you have any other tequilas that you think I should feature with this five to try. Remember, find some, buy some, try some. I'm Doug Price, thanks for watching.